Film Review, Sliman, directed by Carlos Pereira. Director Carlos Pereira Sliman is a thought-provoking short film that made its world premiere at the Party di Domani, Concorso Internazionale section of the 76th Locarno Film Festival. This evocative work delves deep into the concerns surrounding queer individuals and the LGBTQ plus community, painting a hauntingly believable future in Germany, where human rights have dwindled, and queer people are pushed to the margins of society, facing dire threats and persecution. What sets Sliman apart is its ability to communicate a powerful narrative indirectly, using symbolism and visual metaphors that resonate profoundly with the audience. It's a testament to the artistry of the filmmaker, who pays meticulous attention to detail and crafts a narrative that speaks volumes without relying on explicit dialogue. The film opens in a bleak prison cell, with only a sliver of a window shedding a feeble, almost extinguished light. This stark imagery serves as a stark commentary on a society in decline, where color has drained away, and life itself seems to have withered. Carlos Pereira captures this desolation, making the viewer acutely aware of the bleak future he portrays. In a scene charged with artistic symbolism, we observe Omar, the central character, seated on a train with his back to the camera, suggestive of the idea that he has left the prison behind. The framing and lighting choices are notable, symbolizing a society devoid of progress, stuck in an unyielding cycle of stagnation. A pivotal moment occurs when Omar's confidant Ava utters the words, nothing feels real anymore. This poignant dialogue alludes to the gradual erasure of queer individuals, as they are systematically marginalized and rendered invisible by society, the government, and those who refuse to accept them. Omar quotes the lines of Greek poet Dinos Christianopoulos, they tried to bury us, they didn't know we were seeds. This verse encapsulates the resilient spirit of queer individuals, refusing to be silenced or suppressed, even in the face of adversity. The film is aptly titled Sliman, and intriguingly, this name belongs to a character who remains conspicuously absent throughout the narrative, reminiscent of the enigmatic function that Samuel Beckett's Gatto serves in his acclaimed play, Waiting for Gatto. Sliman, within the context of the film, serves as a poignant symbol of hope, a hope that has been forcibly exiled, hidden away from sight, and a hope that no one seems to possess knowledge of its whereabouts or condition. Throughout the film, a surveillance entity in the sky symbolizes the oppressive control exerted over queer lives. The use of visual metaphors is nothing short of brilliant, adding layers of depth to the narrative. The deliberate pacing of the film serves as a metaphor for the passage of time and the feeling of confinement, with long shots and vivid imagery creating an immersive experience. The scenes involving a river and a full moon-shaped earring are particularly noteworthy, highlighting the themes of renewal and identity. In its conclusion, Sliman brings the surveillance entity back into focus, juxtaposed against a techno dance scene. The contrasting darkness and flashes of light symbolize the struggle for freedom and self-acceptance. Omar's decision to break free, dance, and embrace his queer identity is a powerful and liberating moment. In conclusion, Sliman is a cinematic gem that skillfully tackles complex themes of queer identity, oppression, and resilience. Carlos Pereira's meticulous attention to detail and use of symbolism make this film a captivating and thought-provoking piece of art that lingers in the mind long after the credits roll. Sliman is a testament to the power of cinema as a medium for social commentary and artistic expression.